Rob, thank you so much. This is a dream come true for me. Uh, for you, it's going to be about five minutes of mediocre comedy, so stick with me. Uh, I'm really happy to be here tonight. Uh, not just for this opportunity, but like most of you, I took the I-95 to get here. And like Ramon said, it's scary. I call it the I Might Die 95. The I Just Saw Some Crazy Shit 95. The I Wanna Go Home 95. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so I used to work at a gym, and I feel like that prepared me for life. Uh, one time this woman came in, she said she wanted to cancel her membership. I said, no problem. Then she said she wanted her money back because she never used it. That's not how this works. I can't make you come. That's up to you. Hey, hey. So I'm single for some reason. Uh, really, it's on me. I punch up, as they say. I always go for the highest quality of character, most successful, most attractive women I can find. And obviously that's not working out. But I'm not gonna give it up. In fact, uh, this girl that I follow just became single recently, so I slid in her DMs. Probably gonna hear back from Sofia Vergara any day now. <laughs> hey, hey. Speaking of, anybody hablas espanol? Uh, estoy practicando mi español, pero yo hablo como un niño. I said I'm practicing my Spanish, but I talk like a child, which is true. But if you didn't understand what I said, maybe you should. That's like grade school level Spanish. You watch a few episodes of Dora the Explorer, you probably pick it up. I actually found a streaming service where I can stream episodes for free. It's called Pornhub. So I streamed like six or eight episodes of that. And instead of swiper no swiping, it's swiper. Que estas haciendo? <laughs> thank you, thank you. You guys are great. It's amazing. Um, so this is my first time on this stage too, by the way. So <laughs> thank you guys so much. Uh, so it seems like everybody has ADHD nowadays. Everyone I know thinks they have ADHD, or they got some money grubby doctor to diagnose them with ADHD and prescribe Adderall. Wow. Uh, which is totally possible. Uh, I'm not a doctor, I don't know. But I think it's also possible we're just a bunch of over-caffeinated dopamine addicts. I feel like those two would be pretty indistinguishable. Anyways, if anybody needs to buy any Adderall, let me know. <laughs> So, good news is, I am in therapy. Appreciate that. Uh, I started therapy about the same time I started writing stand-up. There's no correlation, I'm sure. Uh, but I'm <laughs> having my session with my therapist, and it's going well. Then she gets very serious. She says, uh, I didn't know if I was going to bring this up today or not. I get real nervous. I get prepared for a diagnosis. I get prepared for some bad news. But she continues with, I didn't know if this was appropriate or not, but since we communicate through Google Voice, and that number links to my phone's contacts, the video you posted doing stand-up showed up in my TikTok. And I saw you doing stand-up. You should quit. <laughs> I did what I always do when a woman is mean to me, and I fuck my therapist. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is exactly why I need therapy. Thank you guys so much. That is my set tonight. Have an overcast.